welcome back to Bubble Pop Kids. So I think you know what this video is going to be. We're making some slime putty. And the star of today's slime is going to be Miss Little Sweetie Drops from MLP. Look at this one. This is like the Black Funko Mystery version. She's got her three little candy cutie marks. I am loving her. Uh, we're switching it up a little bit. I'm always using that white plain Elmer's glue, but I found this black sparkly silver glitter glue. Would you look at this? It is amazing. I cannot wait to test this out. And the best part about it, it matches Sweetie Drops color perfectly. Alrighty, everybody. So we're starting. I'm gonna take you guys step by step so you can do this fun craft at home. So the first thing you're gonna need is one empty mixing bowl. And the first step is to dump both of these bottles right in here's one and this look at this it's just too amazing for words it's got the deepest black color almost looks like tar or something like that but those silver sparkles make it so shimmery and pretty just try to squeeze them out the best you can sometimes it's hard to get the glue out of these plastic bottles Whoop. If you're having a tough time getting it out of the bottle, you can add a little bit of warm water, squish it around, and see if that loosens it up. Oh yeah, it worked a little bit. Oh, this is so hard coming out of here. Woo! Our bowl is filled with all the glue. Next up, we're gonna make our borax and water mixture. Besides our little sweetie drops, here is the other star of the show. This is what's gonna turn that glue into slime putty. It is borax, and before you start mixing this, you guys, I always say please have a parent or adult supervising you. Just because it is a laundry detergent, I'm just gonna reach on into the box and get half a teaspoon of this laundry detergent. Doesn't have to be exact, I think that's enough. And I got my little cup of warm water here. I'm just gonna dump that in, swish it around until all of those little crystals are dissolved. It's gonna turn into like a cloudy white color. Boop. Here's the fun part. Well, actually the fun part is gonna be when we decorate this cute little jar with my little pony style. But we have to put this mixture in little increments into the glue. Start mixing it up and see what we get. <laughs> I'm a little nervous, I've never used this kind of glue, but if this does come out, it's gonna be amazing. And just start mixing it away. I know Elmer's glue usually works perfect, but this is some other brand that I couldn't beat it with this amazing color. Ooh, look at all the glitter. Let's just keep swishing it around. It's still super watery so I'm just going to add a little more of that borax and see what happens. Woo! Whoa! <laughs> this is so so cool. This is like black tar slime. I don't know what it is. It looks super gross but then it's kind of glamorous with all those little sparks in there. Ooh, this is probably the funnest one I've ever made. You know that the slime's not ready when it's still sticking to your hands and looking like this, so I have a little bit more of that mixture. Just gonna dump the rest of it in and work it into it. Voila, here we go. I've been mixing this for about three to four minutes. This is the final product, you guys, and I have to say it looks as pretty as it does scary. This is actually a good putty for Halloween, and it all turned into one piece. You are gonna love this. It came out with the best texture, the most sparkle. You could never add this much glitter into glue. It'd have to come already in there like this did. This will stretch, I think it'll stretch for a mile. <laughs> it's just like magic. I have made so many different slime putties, but this has to be the stretchiest, the weirdest. It is amazing, I love it. Look at that, it never breaks. I think I could cover the whole table. It looks like a galaxy, all the little stars. Woo! Love it.
need the super stretchiest formula ever. <laughs> it's just too, too much. Woo, and there's so much of it. You could share it with your friends, but we played with it enough. I think it's time to bottle this up and decorate the jar MLP style. Time to decorate. So I'm sticking this little slimy, crazy looking putty. I love it, so beautiful. <laughs> Into this jar to package it up so it won't dry out. And it's also a super cute room decoration. That's the first step. Now the next step, I'm gonna take our little Sweetie Roll pony here. She matches that amazing. And just get a little bit of super glue right on the bottom of her hooves. And place it right on top of the jar. Hold down for a couple seconds. This is super, super glue, so in a couple minutes, it's gonna be stuck on there. Oop, perfect. Now there are little ponies on the jar. I'm gonna take these amazing black little gem stickers. Usually I use like diamondy ones, but I thought these would match so nice with that glitter slime. And I'm just gonna put them around the top of the jar. So cute. Usually all my My Little Pony putties are like pinks and purples. This one is just so, so different. It's looking amazing. I'm just gonna take a few more of these gem stickers and line the bottom of this. Wow, looks so, so beautiful. So the bottom has some gems. <laughs> it's so girly, even though it's like this dark color. And the so top. we're done with all the sequins. We have a strip on the bottom and the top. Now I'm gonna take a little hot pink puppy paint and go around the top of this. That pink is looking so pretty against those black little gems. Now I'm just gonna put a little bit of this glimmering silver glitter just to make it sparkle a little bit more. Even though this putty is filled with it, I think the little jar could use it. product and I couldn't love it more. <laughs> it has the most unique color. You would never know that was putty inside. It just looks like a black jar. It's so sparkly on the top. Such a pretty room decoration if you love MLP like I do or you can when you're finished with the putty you can put little q-tips or cotton balls in here put it in your bathroom. So many uses for this jar. Here is your putty whenever you want to get to it. Ooh, <laughs> Super super slimy and there it is. We reached the end of the show. So sad, I had so much fun making this black slime putty. It was super squishy and it came out perfect. We are gonna have so many more fun videos coming up just like this. We are Bubble Pop Kids. You can click this big red subscribe button here and subscribe to our channel. Have a great day, bye.